Hey, I'm Decathlon Gamer, and welcome back to Chef Life. This is episode 32. Uh, before we hop into the episode, first off, there there's some construction going on outside. I know that my microphone is picking it up, but I'm not sure if my filters are eliminating it or if it's coming through on the recording. I won't know until afterward. So if it is there, if you're hearing that low hum, uh, there's some work going on outside, so I apologize for that. But let's get on with Chef Life and our first full bistro day. The restaurant phase is completely behind us now, and our entire menu in the coming day and in the coming recipes to learn and or upgrade, it's all bistro level. So first off, our new bistro recipe for the day, as I'm gonna follow that pattern for a little while of unlocking one of them each day and then upgrading as many as I can with the time remaining, whether that's one, whether that's two. Uh, could we have a magical day of four? I doubt it, but for today, it's the crown roast of lamb, blah, 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 blah. I think, if I'm not mistaken, and I could be mistaken because I am by no means an expert, especially as an American. I am, and plenty of Americans are obsessed with them. I am not, but I've watched The Crown. I know a bit about the royal family, and I think, if I'm not mistaken, that this is the dish that's always served to them when they go to their, their royal home in Scotland, wherever that's at. I think <laughs> this is that particular dish, hence the crown roast of lamb. Uh, could be wrong absolutely could be wrong but that's the recipe we're going to start with i'm going to go ahead and unlock it now so it's ready to go in the morning we'll pick it up quickly and then i don't much care which other recipes we upgrade i might just kind of grab whatever's there whatever i feel like in the moment uh, i have no urgency let's have fun with it as we're getting started on the day and of course that first recipe the crown lamb I've installed a new floor. I think it looks really nice. Uh, this is the wood and concrete highest level floor available to you. Makes it a little bit darker in here though, so I might need to change the uh, the darker walls here at some stage to something else. So, you know, more changes coming, but let's go to grab our ingredients and get started on the day. Time always of the utmost importance. Okay, no doubles of anything. already seven there are eight ingredients the last thing is the lamb which should be in here and there is our rack of lamb so we will get started looks like we need to get a pot on boil okay so we'll get that boiling and what ingredients do you need just the just potatoes we don't even have to cut them up quite on the boil we'll we'll wait for it we'll wait for it we'll do it properly it's only a few more seconds there we go and you need some seasoning not enough salt only a little bit of salt necessary here looks like we'll need something else nutmeg later okay that should do it yes perfect all right now what are we doing nothing else gets added Add some heat to that, make that go a little bit faster. Blender is the next stage. But let's just go work. Work on that one of those. Boil. Okay. What do we need for this one? We need to do those boiled potatoes. Gonna turn that heat up. Cover on here shortly. Get that rack of lamb prepped. Nice. Cut it in half, you get two racks. I like that. Turn the heat down just before the end. One of those tricks that may or may not work. Mac 
crashing. It looks like we are. Puree. Okay, sure. Baking dish. And this one looks like it's going in the oven. T2. Alright. In the meantime, there is still more to do. Here's where the nutmeg's gonna come in. One of our weakest areas is that stupid oven. Oh. Or that wood fire one now right next to it and burning the contents. Plating is all that is left after this, so. We have time on both of these. We have time to jump over here and take the asparagus, asparagus risotto. Good and morning, it, chef. It was the first thing on the list, so you know. Hello. Prep station, Kasim. What can you do? What can you do? You can go right to the end on things now, huh? I like that. I like. Okay. Don't really need to prep anything. So why don't you What's up? Make some extras. One of these guys is done, that's probably needing to stir now. Oh, oh yeah. That was a little bit too far gone. Got it. Let's see, what can we do? Can we take? Oh, there's two of them, but I don't think I have two. Of anything else to make double. I just heard it, this is done. Oh, well, there you go. There's more than one. We might just be able to make two. A little bonus XP out of the way here. How's it going today? Yeah, there you go. We do get a double. And that's actually a decent plating. I don't like the white plate, but the use of color on it works. I don't want to change it. I like it. This should finish all of the cleanup for the first recipe and get us into the second. I think I already mm. took care of all of the dishes. Single items can fit it all on our person as we get the second recipe of the day on the go. The upgraded asparagus risotto. Nope, Max, got a situation, Chef. The goods the supplier sent you expire in a few days. Still have a few days before they go bad. Blah, blah, blah. Uh. All right, we do need seasoning here. A lot of salt. Also, black pepper. We need to go back for black Can't pepper. Can't wait to start the evening service. Our customers will be blown away. More salt. That should do it. Okay, we're at the first phase, and we're ready for this. We don't have everything we need. 
yet. How are we doing on the timer on this one? Not too bad. Uh, let's look at our third recipe. Oh, nope, nope, nope. Caprese's already done with the bistro. So, pasta with Italian cheese. Will be the third one we go for today. Fantastic menu today. There we go. Uh, cover. Anything to add? No. Already got the heat turned up. I think we can get started here. What do you need seasoning wise? A lot of black pepper. Still more black pepper. And we enter the first phase where you need this. In the meantime, we got a cold dish. Fix that. Three extras of these. We'll store them there to get them off us for now, but we'll make sure we clean that up later. And we're looking comfortable on the time to get three recipes in today if this is nearly done. Which it might not be. There might be a number of steps remaining. I suppose I could look ahead on that, but uh, let's go heat up. Now go ahead and turn that heat down. And this guy is hot again. Stir. Plating. Plating is all that is left. So we're going to turn that back down. And we're going to go grab our ingredients for the next three eggs. Looks like it will be a good day. Don't think Chef. we need anything. Pancetta. Okay, okay, we have da -da -da -da. three times to get a head start on the XP of plating this guy. These are the weird kind of dishes to try to plate yourself. We could probably do better than that, but um, actually, yes, we could do better than that. There's an achievement for stacking everything. We're going to see if we can do it here. Was I cooking something? No. I finished this. I'll give that some extra special attention. Don't That's two dishes done for the day. Already all of our ingredients, so we'll easily get three done. I don't think we have enough okay. time to squeeze in a fourth, but... We are in pretty good shape, but that plating took some extra time for sure. So. Oh, that's got to get stirred. Almost missed that. I guess that's because I put the egg in. That's why it was needing stirred. Uh, we have an opportunity here that I'm not going to waste. 
I'm not gonna make additional, I'll just make a couple. But I am gonna make a second pasta. Let's get this thing stirred again before it's too late. Pasta is so quick to make, and it gives me a chance to uh, turn out two dishes, get that little XP while we're at this, because I'm, I'm sure we're going to get it a second, right? You would think. And it was really seconds to, you know, to manage that, to do that. Okay, that looks like thick slices. Let's make sure from the recipe that that is thick slices. There it is. Yes. Thick slices for the pancetta, which is already in the meat slicer. And we set it to thick, and we slice. Excellent. Okay, I'm gonna take this away. I don't need it anymore. Place it there. Chopping board, we got a few things to chop. One, two, three. Make sure we don't make any mistakes on this stage. As it's too late to go pick up fresh ingredients. table. There's our other egg. Got some egg yolks. Okay. Getting down there, folks. We got kind of everything prepped. Yeah, is this where we want to make two of them? Probably is, right? <clears throat> uh, we're not going to be able to make two. We'll not get two. Wow, it's hard to see what needs to go in here. Uh, Yes. Stir. I will put that back away. That extra pasta's not going to come in handy. I was hoping you'd make sauce, add pasta. When you make sauce, you get three of them, four of them. Not the case. It's an all-in-one package deal on this puppy. Now, assuming the plating's all that's left, it is. All right, that is three recipes learned. We'll see today in service if we can manage to level up any of the three or all three of the recipes because this is that first time that we're going triple bistro all the way. And we do have one of those original recipes before we were seeing those take an incredibly long time to level up. You had to make it a lot. Of course, we have 20 customers, so you do make things a lot more often with that. I mean, you're getting six or seven a day uh, of a recipe, so that certainly helps, but let's, let's get to the service. All right, Kasim can go straight to the final dish. You know me nice. well. I love uh, that ingredient. You know I love prepping fish. Okay. 
Okay, Adele, in the meantime, can't get to the same level of prep, but the soul she could definitely get into the later stages. Wonderful way with sweet chestnuts. Chef. Maybe we'll have her make a couple of those. No problem, a couple of Chef. those. On it. And we'll turn that into a dish. Now that scallops might have Okay, this one does. The sweet chestnut grilled porcini. In fact, the sauce. That's not even it, right? Wow, those are done done. Okay. <laughs> Somebody's working really fast. Well done, chef. That looks a good, great. Uh, menu for him. I love cooking that. A plus rating. <laughs> Uh, that's gonna get cold. What are we gonna do? We're gonna make some more. And we'll get one more for now. We'll get three of these on me. Uh, there was another component of that. I think it's maybe the chestnuts. And we just made this on the last episode for me recording wise was two or three days ago it hasn't been that long but yeah, I'm thinking it's the uh, chestnut it's a chopping board item it is a chopping board item but which one is it Ready? And one of those. Could be the mushroom. I think it's the chestnut. Let's find out. Nope, it's not the chestnut. Oh, no, was it something you chop? Could it be the truffle? Be the truffle or the mushroom? I think. Ah, there it is. It is the truffle slivers. Okay. And then. Yes, we have everything we need. We'll plate two of these. Send them out a fraction of a second nice later. Plating, chef. We'll just, Makes you know, you eat it. tell the... <laughs> tell them that, you know, could only carry... The waiter couldn't carry four plates at once. I'll make them come back here and throw a, a little brace on their wrist or something, you know? <laughs> What was that level to ready to level up already? No way. Sounds like it. Okay, uh, we can get a couple more truffles ready, but I need to get them doing stuff. Let's go with Kasim. Uh, I have nothing ready. Working so with that two. ingredient is so and fun. Two. And then Adele. We also used up everything we needed here, so two. Yes, chef. And two. Okay, That's chef. my speciality. You're going to love it. So he's doing two recipes straight to plating. She's just working on the other one and myself. Actually, really for that matter. So this is Adele and I combining. 
imagine what's gonna happen when you get all of them to level 20. That's gonna be super easy. Actually, that's that's how things work. I have a couple of employees, and it's always coming down to the reliability and how helpful they are and how on it they are it makes an absolute world of difference. Same outside of the daycare when it comes to uh, still no orders yet when it comes to being a coach my assistant coaches same thing I have have had and have some that are totally on it and step up and help and do so much and are involved and lead drills and I have others that just sit back and do absolutely nothing and are still in that I'm learning phase Seems already finished two dishes. Let's go ahead and make I it love a third working with that each. That's my speciality. It's so fast. You're going to love it. <laughs> it's insane. Yeah. Look at his movement. Like he's just like He's like a Jedi. He played it. Making life so easy on me here. Kasim. Talking about how great it is, but now we've got to get used to it. Alright, that means we're going to need to queue up a couple replacements on that. Too. She's working on the last piece of that. And meanwhile, we have space for. I love cooking that. More there. Now, is that going to help me level that dish up fast, or not? As I'm not the one plating. Without the plating, am I getting the XP? Mm, big question. Be making life easy on me, but it may also put the XP in his hands and not in mine. Can't tell from here. Table order. Here's what they want. Two souls. It's on its way. Okay, this is not leveled up. That's just technical execution bonuses. We're halfway through the level. The order's ready to go off quick. This is going to be our fastest ever. 20 customer day by far. Uh, Seems got nothing to do right now, and I don't want. I Feel don't free want to get to me working complete. on something. I want him to. I can help. Sure thing. Give me. Right away. No problem. I want to try plating and see 
Am I getting anywhere with XP, or do we have a long ways to go yet? That's everything I need. Yes. Alright, so we are plating one ourselves. And we will see how the XP is looking. Is it still minimal? Oh, it's still minimal. It is still minimal. So, uh, the plan. The plan is. We have three more of those, so I'm going to get Kasim. Leave it to me. No problem. Make three more. Let's see where that puts us. So we <laughs> as helpful as it is that he's insanely fast in getting through this. Uh, it's also detrimental to leveling up the recipe, which is exactly what the main goal is. Okay, I need truffles. Uh, let's do three. And cut a, I can slice all three at once, or whatever it is. No, tr slivers, yeah, slice. <laughs> whatever we're calling that thing. Help out. Jiro's probably backed up a little bit. Let's wash one of them or so. No customers arriving. Uh, there's a soul that has been ordered. Do you and need my need help for anything? Take that. And that. Ooh. Running that one a little close, huh? Seems already done. <laughs> uh, I want to get one more from him right now. Let's play this one. And then I need to give them an assignment. I'm getting a little caught up. This is this is harder. <laughs> this is harder to manage. I mean it would be super, super easy. But it would come with absolutely no XP whatsoever. And that's definitely not what we're aiming for here. Oh, we've got two of those ordered. We'll leave that. Looks like it's already returned to a hot status. Oh, that's table seven. That's got to be just about it for the day. Uh, Kasim. Right away. Give me one more of these, right? I have On it. one left. Two left. I have what I need for one right here, right? Okay, that would do the one more. There's one last table. One last customer, I think. Not much point belaboring Give me a challenge, chef, or the issue just here. Really. It's just about a day. We'll serve straight from here. I think it is the final customer. If I'm guessing, I think it's the final customer. Once that gets picked up, that should be that. Well done, Chef. Nice work. Aha. And, and another service done. I made those last two dishes a disappear as well. I have no cleanup to do. Besides two ingredients on my hand and a few extra made dishes. And we got a 100% for everything today. And we're going to get well over a thousand. My expenses for the day, I think, was about 340. We're close to level 27. That was a good day. But I don't think we managed to. As we'll clean this up. I don't think we managed to get any of them leveled up today and that was the disappointing part soul we got nowhere with 
I made a lot of the scallops once I knew. Uh, and the third one, with Adele's help, we worked on throughout the day. Uh, so we need to check on those three and see just how far we got. Autumn soup was one of them today. Oh, are you kidding me? One more. One more autumn soup, and it's a done deal. And I have a plan. I think what I'm going to end up doing on the next day is instead of keeping it on the menu, I'll put the other five on the menu that we have available to us, and we would take one autumn soup as a learn the menu item thing and just make one ourselves, And that should do it. Maybe I have to make two uh, to be safe. So maybe we'll just make two ourselves uh, over the course of the day as our learned recipe, which means we would learn two new recipes. But of the five, will I have two ready to level up with two new recipes coming out? No, I don't think so. I think the the more likely outcome is that we have uh, this one's done the other one that we had let's see here the other one soul we didn't practice scallops and sauce yeah see I would think this would be done tomorrow right got more than halfway through the day we know what to do with it now and we know kind of where we have to go to, to get that one done. We can have Kasim make one or two real quick to get us started to put away and then <laughs> make them, make them, make them, make them ourself. And then start working on something like the soul in the same manner. Uh, but we know we can make that one to order with Kasim in seconds. So I don't really even need to keep it on on high but that that frees up one slot for the next day for two new ones so yeah different strategy now because now it's not just about hammering out recipes as fast as possible now it's getting them to level up and that's a trickier ordeal especially when you have somebody like Kasim who's fully leveled up and steals the XP away from us uh, while producing dishes very very quickly so breaking that back down so that we can get the XP to level it up. New strategies coming into play as we are now into Bistro completely from here on out. That is going to do it for this episode, though. I'm Decathlon Gamer. Like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Have a good one. Be safe out there. Bye for now.